Hi, Kathy McCool here, and I want to review the RAS Kids program. Um, Noah and I have been using the AR books mostly, and he's been using the RAS Kids here just in class. But um, I now am going to start working with using him, using this with him at home too. So the first thing I did was I went to the kids a through z.com. You can see right here. And I'm searching the teacher's name, and it's K Reed 4. So you can choose Go. And then it'll come up with all of the students' names. So I'm choosing my son, and then the, their password. So you'll have to ask them what their password is. And this gets into the reading program. So this is exactly what they see on their iPads um, at school when they're doing the reading. And so you'll see here on the level up, this shows them what they need to complete. So you can see these books have been completed. It's been listened to, read, and the questions have been completed for that book. Um, and then these books here, this still needs read and listened to and the questions. Um, you can see Noah is almost done with level H right here, getting ready to move to level I. So now that I'm gonna be working with him at home, I'm gonna go through and really work with him on these books that need to be knocked out. Um, it looks like he's partially done with this one. So we can finish those out. Okay, then I'm going to go back here to the reading and the reading room here is where they go in and they do their reading at school. It looks like there's all kinds of topics um, in nursery rhymes, um, sounds and symbols, so all kinds of things you can use, a great resource. Um, what I'm going to focus on is these level books. So this actually brings them in at the level that they're at, they've been assigned, and I'll show you on the parent side in a minute how that's done. But this shows all the level H books. This is the, the level that Noah's in now and all the ones that we need to complete. So you can see he's been doing a lot of them at, in class at school um, and completing the quizzes all on his own. So this is great progress. I'm really excited to see this. So that's kind of the kids side, so that what they see. Um, and now what I wanna go through and just show you guys um, the parent side. So you can actually go to the parent tab here and log in. So I actually was given um, my email access um, through Miss Leanne, so you'll have to get that if you don't already have that. And then I created a password so that I can log in as the parent. Okay, so here's the parent view. And you can see here, it shows the last five books that he's read. Um, and it shows right here the level. So this is that level that we're talking about um, that you saw earlier, okay? And then it just shows a summary of all of the um, reading he's been doing, how much time he's spent on it, how many um, stars he's earned, and um, those type of things, okay? And then you can see here the activity. And this is just run for the last seven days. You can also run it for the last 30 days. Um, and just kind of see all the things I've done. So you can see where I said the quizzes. So he did the listening, the reading, and then the quiz on that book. So it shows um, each day what they're working on. So it's like the 25th, he did quite a bit of um, reading and quizzes. Um, and you can see kind of what they're going through here, okay? And then on the assignment tab, this just shows the levels that he's at and which books we still need to knock out, which also showed easily on the child's side, the child's view. So we just need to go through and knock out the rest of these books. The level progress, this is pretty neat um, view. You can see here at the level that they're at versus the grade. So right here is the grade that they're in and then the level where they're at. Okay, so my goal now that I'm gonna be working with Noah on this at home is to increase this level and knock out all his level H books so we can move up to that level I as you guys saw earlier, um, as you guys saw earlier on the children's screen, okay? And it's pretty neat because you can run the, the summary here over time. So as we go out through the school year, you can see the progress. Of course, this was, um, when they were in kindergarten. So you can see the progress. It'll be really neat to see by the end of the year where they end up with all the progress they've been doing reading. And then I sent a message. You can actually send a message to your students. So I just typed no a little message. So it actually shows he has an alert when he goes in the next time to read. And I just put that I'm proud of him. Um, it's just fun to send those little, those little love notes. So that's kind of the progress here. Um, and like I said, my goal 
is to go through and um, get everything reading to get bring up to his next level. So we want to really push to get to the next level and just continue to add to the logged times and the logged hours. So I hope that's helpful. Um, if you have any questions, um, please reach out to Miss Leanne. She can help. Um, she's a professional at this, but I thought it'd be helpful for us to all see the video um, and kind of what the kids are seeing and what access we have too. So happy reading. Bye guys.